guys welcome back to my bubble and as you can see by the title of this video i hate that you guys i'm always like chopped off anyways that's better as you can see by the title of this video i have a mukbang it's homemade burgers made by yours truly okay so this is what they look like just cheese the meat filming some chips and a can of dry ginger ale and of course some um, Frank's Red Hot because surprisingly I don't have ketchup I don't have ketchup you guys you know I love me my ketchup but hot sauce will do how have you guys been it is Tuesday and your girl is home Your girl is home. I'm always usually home on Mondays, but my global baby. My global baby had an appointment today. So I had to take him for his treatment. I believe that in one of my old videos I spoke to you guys about um me taking him to the vet and how we were treated and blase blase oh, I'm sorry papa so I took him today for the second dose of his treatment because he had a ear infection he still has it it is doing better and let me tell you guys about that I want you guys to see like I put my onions and I hate that it's not focusing Um, before I take him, I did give him, um, the little pills that they gave me so that I can give him so to calm him down because my baby does get aggressive around other people that, you know, aren't his family. So I gave him one at 9.15 this morning. My appointment was at 10.45. It was so crazy because those pills worked so fast this time. Twenty minutes later, <coughs> I see Guevo tripping and shit. I was like, oh my god, I'm breathing all heavy. that they work this time because he was on an empty stomach like he hadn't eaten anything this morning so I think that's why they kicked in nicely and honestly I hated to see him that way but it just made the whole experience at the vet 10 times better like mm -hmm. I already complained about this place to you guys I hate it they make my dog out to be like the worst doggy out there and he isn't he's actually the best um but yeah he could be a little aggressive you know so today he just he cooperated nicely like i kid you not i mean he was weak he was like high if anything he had no strength in him at all whatsoever the doctor even complimented him. He was like, oh, good boy, good boy. Did you give him the ace? I guess they call it ace. 
And I told him, yeah, I only gave him one. He was like, oh, one, wow. And I was like, yeah, but I guess it was because he's on an empty stomach. Oh, wow. Did you guys hear that? So maybe that's why. <clears throat> so, um, they gave him his treatment, um, told me to go back um, next Monday, follow up, recheck, you know, see if it got better, if it needs more, yada yada. Now, the person that took me to the vet this morning is a friend of mine who has a van, like a really big van, where I can, you know, put my doggy in with no problem. Because cab drivers don't be wanting to take your dog, especially if he's not in a cage or if he's as big as Wibble. And, <laughs> to top it off, doesn't cooperate. So I always gotta call this individual to give me a hand, you know? Unfortunately, he couldn't pick me up. Um, I was done pretty quickly at the vet today. Again, because my dog cooperated. Didn't give anybody a hassle. Um, he wasn't expecting me to be done so quick. So, He went ahead and did other things. He told me that for him to pick me up, I would have to wait around two hours. I couldn't wait around two hours, you know? Especially when my dog is all high, tripping all over the place, you know? So I said, you know what? Fuck it. I know my way home. It is a bit of a walk, especially with a dog who can't walk at the moment, who's weak and who's tripping and, you know? But I had to troop it, I had to troop it out. So, I took Gwibble's 40 pound ass home, carried, all right? You know I was determined to get my baby home safe. Because he's heavy. That was a workout for my arms. I know tomorrow morning I'm going to wake up sore. People were looking at me <clears throat> like I was crazy. Some of them were yelling, oh, he's heavier than you. Fart. Oh, that was silent. <laughs> that was so silent. Oh my god, my camera is gonna die. That sucks. Oh, he's heavier than the new people were saying. Um <laughs> But I got him home. I would stop like every five minutes, but I made sure that my baby was okay. Cause every time that I would have him walk a little bit. He would like put his paws on my shoulder, like kind of like, kind of like telling me, mommy, I can't make it. Mommy, I can't do it. Mommy, I can't do it. So I said, it's okay, baby. Mama got you. And I carried my baby home. And we're here. We made it. Mm. My camera's not gonna make it though. So that was what my morning was looking like. Now I got home, showered, bathed the babies, <clears throat> made some burgers, and now I'm just filming this video for you guys. You feel me? My world was coming back to his senses. 
Sorry. So, <clears throat> that's my mission, you guys. I'm going to call it a mission because I say I hate saying the word gold. So, that's my mission for the month of January, to cure my dog. I say cure as if he has some deadly disease. But you know what I mean. Like, you know, to make sure that he's good, to make sure that that ear infection goes away, go to all his appointments, make sure he's good, 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 because... That's my baby. That's my baby. If I don't take care of him, nobody will. I love him to pieces. And he knows that. He knows that. As long as he knows, I'm good. You feel me? For those of you pet owners, do you guys love your pet the way I love my huevo? Because it's amazing. It's just amazing to me. Like, I love that nigga. That's my baby. It's so crazy because... I didn't like no animals. Like, I was scared of dogs. I didn't want no dog in my life. I, so. so, he came around. Mmm. Mmm. -mm. Mm -mm. It's the simple things in life, you guys. It's the simple things in life. I put some onions in there. Mm -hmm. Hopefully my lipstick's not smeared all over. So my phone died, you guys. Oh, that's why the quality looks different. I mean, my phone. My camera died. I'm using my phone now. Excuse my lipstick, you guys. I know this right here looks gross.
Oh, that was good. That was real good. Anyways, baby's on their shit again. Uh, so I'm going to end this right here. I have to. I mean, there's nothing else left. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.